if we were to discover a theory that fully unifies quantum mechanics and general relativity, what do you think would be the most in unexpected application for our understanding reality or the nature of consciousness? The answer is honestly, I don't know. <laughs> and that sounds like a bit of a cop out, but again, if I'd asked people at the foundation of quantum mechanics, what do you think the application of quantum mechanics is going to be? No one would have said positron emission tomography for treating cancer, right? No one would have said it's going to build us devices that allow us to watch videos of cats. And yet these are the outcomes through silicon transistors and so on of the advent of quantum mechanics. Similarly, if, I, if I'd learned about general relativity, I wouldn't have predicted the existence of GPS satellites. I wouldn't have said self-driving cars someday in the future are going to really need this to be able to navigate their way around San Francisco. So I think that kind of speculation is healthy. And I think science fiction authors probably have a better idea than I do of what might come out of this. Okay. But the honest answer is there will be, for the reconciliation to happen, something will change. So there's some rule of quantum mechanics or general relativity or possibly both that has to change that will open up a new world of possibilities. And until we know what that is, we don't know what that world of possibilities will be.